All right. Challenge mode or mission mode? Challenge mode or mission mode? Let's start out with mission mode. And maybe we'll switch over to challenge mode later. All right, well, um... Syx was... not him. <laughs> Syx was stupidly good in our previous mission mode, so we're using him. And don't worry, I'm not going to be spending hours on my panels this time. I only have to equip two new panels. I'll just take some extra casts of magic. That's fine. I don't think we really need magic, but... It's worth having. Alright. He did get stuck on Dark Sora for a while, that's true. Alright, uh... Pfft, yeah, let's do... Let's. Oh, wait, hang on. Wait. Did I just see it say... No mission crowds are awarded for this mission. Well, why the heck would I ever do it, then? Let's eliminate the avalanche. In Twilight Town. Alright, now we just have to remember where the avalanche is. Oh, and we also collect tokens. What do you mean I can't open the gate? Now I can. Avalanche is down here, I do declare. At least I think he is. Actually, no, maybe he's not. Oh, wait, no, Avalanche is in the uh, sand lot, actually. New, new, new. This is the most Syx has ever. This is the most fun that Syx has ever had. He doesn't have any real hobbies. Yeah, here, here we go. Avalanche should be over here. Oh no. Is he immune to lightning? Oh my gosh, yes, Syx! Syx smash! Sykes' critical hit rate is just unfair. Ha! Easy. Easy fight. I know I'm super over-leveled for this, but still. Uh-oh, we gotta collect more tokens. That's okay, there was a token I missed in the first room. I love how fast the glide is now that I have all of the glide level ups. There we go. Alright, four mission crowns or just. Yay, four mission crowns. My favorite. Eliminate both giant heartless, heat saber, and a destroyer. Shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> with with Mr. Moon. I don't like Sykes' limit break, but his just generic attacks are ridiculous. Alright, I think this is the Heat Saber? Yes, it is. Ouch.
Oh, yeah. <laughs> what the heck? Did I just take out three bars of his HP with the finishing blow of my combo? Yeah, that's... When they say critical hits, they are not kidding. Alright, and then is the destroyer at the station? I believe he is. Wow, that was ridiculous. Okay, yes, Ix is completely broken. <laughs> and I love it. <laughs> I feel like mission mode is more just catharsis for challenge mode. Ooh, and we got a power check. Awesome. Collect shining shards. We can do that. That's an easy mission. Off to the tram common. All right. Got to kill the guardians. <laughs> it's easier than you'd think. My gosh, Saix's finishing blows are stupid. Enemies? What enemies? <laughs> Alright, where's the last one? There he is. Give me that shining shard. This is this is Wow. I get I now see why people said that Saix was broken in mission mode. And why I was like, he's not that good. It's because he wasn't high enough level. <laughs> that's that's hilarious. Alright, we can do one or two more missions, then we're going over to challenge mode. Uh, Sure, let's collect hearts in Wonderland. <laughs> With Saix. <laughs> Seems reasonable to me. I also like how you can easily skip all the cutscenes. Oh, I hate these guys. There we go. That's one down! Alright. Where are the rest of them? That was just one guy. Alright, cool, cool. Oh hey, it's another guy. And they said you need magic. No, you don't. You just need Psyx. <laughs> All right, that's the first couple of them. Go. That's right, hit the chair. Oh, hey, it's you.
This is ridiculous. Look into that HP bar disappear. That's ridiculous. <laughs> but I love it. Try the bottle. No, you drink it, Saix. You don't smash it. There we go. Only free mission crowns. Aw, oh, man. Alright. <laughs> Eliminate the pink concertos. We'll do that one. Do, 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 do. These guys are annoying, but with magic and Saix, they should be pretty easy. <laughs> ah, yes, Gochi Wonderland textures. Gotta love them. I already forget what the Cheshire Cat told us. Oh, I think it's about the flowers. Watch that health bar just magically disappear! Oh, how lovely. There's no escape from Saix. Ridiculous. <laughs> but also very in character for him. He is the berserker of the team. I love how you can play as the different organization for team members in this. It's so fun and so unique. That's kind of the, one of the reasons why I really wish they made a... like a remake of this game with good online mode. <laughs> And there you have it. Just one left. <laughs> wow! That one hit took out three bars of HP, at least. Crazy! Yeah, Saix breaks the game. And it is glorious. I, I like things that break the game in a fun way. Okay, Saix ground combos are ridiculous. Normally, the air combos are the way to go, and not with Saix. Free mission crowns. Alright, let's redeem those. We get Mega Ephers, Time to 10, and the Ultima Gear. Let's see, we have 110 crowns? There we go. Yep. That seems like a good place to switch over to challenge mode. Wunderbar. Alright. Always make sure that you save after mission mode, because if you don't, you do not get to keep the crowns or any of the rewards you got.
Cheers. What's this? Cheers. All right. All right, which rain do I have equipped first off? I have the extreme rain. Let's unequip that. <laughs> I'm on to you this time. Let's get critical sun. What magic spells do I have equipped? I have some of everything. Okay. Let's get another fire. Do I have any more Fundagas? I do. And two more Fundagas. There we go. Alright. Now, looking under challenges, we have to avoid taking damage against the six giant Heartless. I'm gonna have to look something up before I get that. Earn lots of Heart Poisons while eliminating the six giant Heartless. Yuck. No thank you. Because that would require defeating the Dust Flyer. Um... Defeat the commanders in record time. I've heard this is one of the toughest missions. And, like, you literally have to do it perfectly. Uh, heartless fret. That's... That's another annoying one. Finish your record time for collecting hearts. Maybe that one. I've also heard Scorching Sphere in record time. You literally only have 45 seconds. Let's see. Avoid taking it. Let's try avoiding taking damage here. No attack magic. Sure. Because <laughs> the mission wasn't hard enough. Let's at least, let's at least try this. Just avoid the first room. We gotta enter the games. Oh, wait. Is this the mission where we have to fight Zigbar in the games? I hope not. It probably is, though. Well, let's see how good we can do. Also, we're level 20 with no attack magic, and we can't get hit even once. Have fun! Alright, first battle went okay. Alright, round two, okay. Maybe the key for this is to actually use the exploding barrels. That's right, this is the one of the stupid ghosts. Oh, yes! That is exactly the key. Oh, I've, well, we could take at least a little damage. I don't know why barrels do so much damage. There we go, though. We're still at free sigils, which is astonishing to me. Alright. This... So this is gonna suck. Alright. Nice aim, Roxas. If we can take out the weird flying pink guys, the cannon shouldn't be much trouble. But Roxas has really bad aim, as usual. Oh, that works! <laughs> okay, use the barrels. That is the key for the games. There's an explosive barrel at the top. I like ye. All right, that's what I'm looking for. Okay, how did I not know about this on my first playthrough? Dog on it, Roxas. There we 
we go. There we go. All right. Man, the barrels are fantastic. The problem is Zigbar. Yep, Zigbar. This is where it all goes pear-shaped. No. Oh my gosh, did I beat it? I took kind of a lot of damage in that. Oh wait, no, there's still the boss after this where we team up. Oh, that's right. Okay. It's going to break apart. I don't know how much damage I'm allowed to take, but I'm assuming it's not much. No, I lost one! That sucks. I'm kind of surprised I was allowed to take this much damage, to be honest. Alright, I'll take two sigils at least. We'll have to go back and finish that later, maybe after I get the pattern down a little bit better. Alright, we almost got all three. I'll take two though, that's still some progress. No attack magic, enemy level plus 30. No thanks! Let's see, any more Agrabah missions? Not doing that one. Plant the device in record time. We might be able to do that. Uh, let's do some Halloween Town one. Ugh. We'll try. We'll try Leech Grave again, but we're gonna need to. Uh, we're gonna need to do some preparation. So first off, we absolutely are going to need a lot more fire. We're gonna be taking as much fire as we can as we can. We're also gonna need a lot of cures. Cause Leech Grave is a very sucky enemy. Maybe a Honestly, maybe a limit recharge as well. Nah, we'll just stick with elixirs. Actually, we have enough elixirs. I'll equip a couple more Kiras. Because, yeah, Kiras are going to be very important for this fight. That should be good. Alright, now we equip a bunch of fire. You really can't go overboard with the fire on this. Because we want as much fire as we possibly can get, so we can burn those stupid tentacles. So that's like the only reliable way of killing them quickly. Alright. Restore the town's heartless in record time. I hope they're generous with that time limit, because this takes a long time. We can't do the safe strat for the leech grave anymore. We have to do the really risky going guns blazing and pray that Kira plus auto life and limit breaks are enough to, uh. Yeah. These tentacles are basically impossible to take out if you don't have a bunch of fire.
All right, tentacles are dealt with. Off to the graveyard. I really hope that... I Again, I really wish that you could see the visible time limit on the screen. That would be so helpful. Instead of just being like, Oh, you, you passed the invisible time barrier. Now you lost a sigil. And nope. Oh, <laughs> thank you for homing in, Fire. I wasn't kidding when I said we needed to bring a bunch of fire. Look at how many of these tentacles there are. Take this. Take that. Take that. Oh, you're here too? All right, there we go. Gear component C. Grand. All right. It's party time, Woody. I'm gonna. Oh, no recovery magic. That's not good. Alright. We actually can't do the super risky strategy because we have no recovery magic, apparently. Does that also mean no elixirs? No, we can use elixirs. Kidding me? They keep moving away as soon as I'm about to kill them. Are you? <laughs> I am almost out of fire. I just want to point out. After I kill this tentacle, I will be out of fire. No. Are you serious? The stupid tentacle. There we go. Oh, thank goodness the time limit was generous. We even needed an elixir for that. Oh wait, we're not out of the woods yet. Please don't be stupid with the time limit going back. Like, I beat that basically as fast as you possibly could. Given what we were restricted. But wow, if if we actually got free sigils for that, that was not as big of a deal as I thought it would be. Um, thanks, camera. Did we get it? Did we get it? Free sigils? All right. Wow, Leech Grave was not as hard as I was afraid of. Avoid taking damage. Enemy level plus 50! Yum! You know what? Because we have all the fire equipped, we'll try it, but... I don't think this is gonna work. We'll try it, but... Ugh. Avoid taking damage, so... Mmm. We're gonna have to be really patient in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I hate it how you can't cast magic for like the first second or two. Oh my gosh, and look how much HP these stupid tentacles have now. Huh, Leech Grave is gonna take like a half hour to beat all by himself, isn't he? Alright, there we go. That's the first part done. Man, if we could do all the Leech Grave missions tonight, though, that would be great. <laughs> also, I have been informed that you can use a pumpkin bomb to blow up that crack even more. Which I did not know about, so that's a shortcut to the Curly Hill. Distance, that's what's safest. But I don't want to waste a, f a four fire just on that last bit of HP. <laughs> Thank you. You know what? The Tim Allen sound effect does lift my spirits. Thank you. I just feel like, especially, okay, first off, no taking damage against the Leech Grave. That's going to be really rough. Second of all, he's level plus 50. I shudder to think how much HP this Fane is going to have. I, can I use Recovery Magic now? Well, it doesn't, I guess it doesn't matter, because I'm not supposed to take damage in the first place. Alright, well... Here we go. So we're gonna have to be... very, very careful. What the heck? That's not good. Hey, hey. I saw that. Alright, there we go. I think this is just going to be a battle of patience. Like, we gotta wreck the Tenaclaws. Then wallop his body. Nope! Don't like that! go? Where did the last ten o'clock go? Oh, he's way over there. This phase isn't too hard, it's just... How long... <laughs> how many times am I gonna have to do this? Uh oh 
the stupid poison gas was still there. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to do this so much. Look at how little damage I'm doing compared to how much damage he has. Or how much HP he has. Will I have enough elixirs for this? The boss looks cool, but boy, this is a grind fest. Stop moving out of the way right as the fireball reaches you. That's bad manners. Oh, come on! Ugh. I don't like that. Alright, that's stupid. So that, that fight's literally just going to take, like, a full hour to do. That's a bad challenge right there. That is just, that is just flat out a bad challenge. Hmm. Are there any others I could do? Finish right... No, I think, I think pretty much the... You know what? I'll try one more. There's one more I will try, and then we're going to end. I'm going to see if I can escape the castle while avoiding taking damage. No recovery magic, no recovery items. Enemy level plus 20. But I can still use fire. Alright. We get to beat up Saix. Now, unfortunately, I don't know Saix's pattern, so we're probably going to lose. Love the music, though. <laughs> yeah, Leech Grave does look a little bit like Dead Hand. Dead Hand is much more fun, though. Hi, Saix. Fire does a decent amount of damage against him. That's nice. Oh, hi. You jumped way over there. How dare you? Saix, I'm using you in mission mode. How are why are you doing this? <laughs> Fire actually does decent damage against him for a boss. I do not know what I'm supposed to how I'm supposed to dodge these attacks. Am I supposed to guard some of these? This guy's easy casually, but I mean, if you're trying to avoid damage entirely, that's very different. <laughs> very different. Oh, what a butt. He literally waited for my guard to go up before attacking. Alright, well that's not going to work. I've, yeah, the rest of these I think I literally will need to look up how what the strat is. 
Oh, that's a bobber. Also, did it save that I used an elixir in that failed leech grave fight? It probably did. Dog on it. Alright, well, that's all the time I have tonight.